So how are you doing today? Uh, we have your tiger and what we're going to do right now is talk about the current maintenance, how everything works and how it goes on. Uh, this is pretty straightforward. First off, uh, as you may notice, we've got a lot of extra fur here around the neck and mantle area. This is meant for you being able to tie it into the suit that you have. I don't know what you've got or the design of your suit, but you can cut all of this down accordingly if you need to uh, or tuck it inside the suit. I don't know what you had exactly have planned but uh, I just left it long so you guys have a lot to work with here. Now basically care and maintenance on this thing is you don't want to ever saturate the mask, you don't want it to get rained on, uh, that could delaminate the uh, composite that this is made out of, and, uh, but you should be able to take a wet uh, sponge or washcloth. No cleaner should ever have any alcohol base on it or it'll uh, cause the dyes to run. Just water, maybe a very mild soap if you get a place that's dirty. In most cases, because this is a mono acrylic, dirt really doesn't stick to it, so you should be able to just brush it out. The brush will be coming with him in the box. Uh, and that's pretty much it. Just make sure that you know if you do clean, need to clean him, just uh, don't use anything that's got an alcohol base because that will ruin the mask. Now, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to walk you through. The mask is fully padded on the inside. I'm going to flip the mask over. I'm going to show you how the mask goes on. And the first part of that is grabbing in between the tear ducts right here, which is giving you your pivot point. And you just roll the mask forward and then roll the fur back. Now, as you may notice, we are, again, fully padded on the inside here. Along with the uh, top portion, which basically um, uh, gives you the support on top of the head. You've got a fully padded jaw system here. And the unit is fully adjustable because this is a basically a hard hat band so you can adjust it for whoever's going to be wearing it. And the mask simply goes on from back to front. So just like you're putting on a welder's helmet, you simply do this. Well, first take the glasses off. Then you roll all the fur down. Ah, there you go. Hi. So uh, that's it. Uh, the jaw uh, moves with your jaw. Uh, you can adjust, which I'll show here in a, show, in a moment, the armature that controls it. Yeah, 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 yeah. And that's it. So um, there you go. One very, very pretty tiger. Um, so I'm going to take the mask off now. It just comes off in reverse. And if you need to adjust the jaw to fit the person, the actor that's wearing it, you're just going to be bending this armature here. This is some cold rolled steel here. Take a pair of pliers and just tweak it a little bit, give you an up or down a little bit to uh, make the adjustment. Also make sure to uh, have the head mask fairly tight. Uh, you can again adjust this uh, according to which, whatever you need. Um, but adjust this, then adjust this, and you should be good to go. Again, from back to front. Hi there. Just that easy. Have a great day, and I uh, hope you enjoy it.